Now, we need to add or subtract a multiple of a thousand, so a number that ends in three zeros. First, we have 3,924 plus 3,000. Now, because we're only adding thousands, not adding hundreds, tens, or ones, what we can do is highlight our thousands digits, and 3 plus 3 is 6, so our answer is 6,924, because our hundreds, tens, and ones stayed the same. Now, 4,905 plus 2,000. Again, we can highlight our thousands digits, and 4 plus 2 is 6, so our answer is 6,905, because we weren't adding any hundreds, tens, or ones, so these digits stay the same in our answer. Now, 2,593 minus 2,000. If we highlight our thousands digits, we have 2 minus 2, which is 0, so we're not going to have any thousands in our answer. Our answer is just 593, so our hundreds, tens, and ones digits stay the same, but what we've done here is take away the thousands in the number that we started with. Finally, let's look at 5,999 minus 3,000. Highlighting the thousands digits, 5 minus 3 is 2, so our answer is 2,999. If we look back to this first question, we started with 3,924, and we were adding 3,000. So that's just adding 3,000 blocks to give us 6,000s in our answer. Or, using place value counters, again, we're starting with 3,924, but because we're only adding 3,000s, our hundreds, tens, and ones stay the same. Then, we had 4,905 plus 2,000. So, if we add 2,000 blocks, you can see that we now have 6,000s, and all of our other place values have stayed the same. Or, we could show adding 2,000 with place value counters, and that gives us 6,000s, and we still have 900s, 0 tens, and 5 ones in our answer. Then, we had 2,593 minus 2,000. So here, we were taking away our 2,000 blocks to leave us with 593 as our answer. Or, we can show the same thing using place value counters. Here, we've just subtracted the thousands from our number, so the hundreds, tens, and ones stay the same in our answer. Finally, we had 5,999 minus 3,000. So here, we're just taking away three of our thousand blocks to leave us with two thousands in our answer, and of course our hundreds, tens, and ones stay the same, because we're subtracting a multiple of a thousand. Or, we can show the same thing using place value counters, and you can see that because we started with five thousands and took three of them away, we have 2,000s in our answer, with the other digits staying the same.